We're going to make a flower. Inflate a balloon leaving a 5 inch flat tail. Twist the first soft a half an inch bubble. We're going to use the first bubble to help us make the tulip twist. So, uh, for the first bubble, one inch inside of the balloon. Then you twist the second soft one inch bubble. The first bubble is inside of the balloon. We have made the tulip twist. Twist the third soft one inch bubble. The first bubble stays inside of the third bubble. Lock both ends of the third bubble in one lock twist. Twist the fourth soft one inch bubble. Lock both ends of the fourth bubble in one lock twist. Twist the fifth soft one inch bubble. Lock both ends of the fifth bubble in one lock twist. Fix all bubbles in proper position. We have made the top of the flower. The next three bubbles we're going to twist to make the bird body fold. Twist the sixth three inch bubble. Twist the seventh three inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Twist the eighth three inch bubble. Lock the free end of the 8th bubble between the 6th and the 7th bubbles. You have to roll the 6th and the 7th bubbles around the 8th bubble. You have made the bird by default. Fix all bubbles in proper position. Congratulations, we have made the blossom. I want to make this flower on a long stem. All the next bubbles are going to be a part of the stem. Twist the ninth 5 inch bubble. Twist the tenth soft 1 inch bubble. Twist the eleventh soft one inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Lock both ends of the tenth bubble in one lock twist. At the same time, you lock both ends of the eleventh bubble in one lock twist. Twist the twelfth soft one inch bubble. Lock both ends of the twelfth bubble in one lock twist. The last three bubbles we twisted to keep the leaves that we're going to make in proper positions. The rest of the balloon is the 13th bubble. You can use the scissors to cut off the 13th bubble or do it with uh, your fingers. At the end of the balloon between bubbles. Now we are going to make the stem and uh, leaves for this flower. Inflate a green balloon leaving a 5 inch flat tail. Twist the first green uh, 6 inch bubble. Twist the second green 5 inch bubble. Twist the third green 5 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. 
like both ends of the second bubble in one lock twist. At the same time you lock both ends of the third bubble in one lock twist. Twist the fourth green uh, 5 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the fourth bubble in one lock twist. The rest of the green balloon is the fifth bubble. We have made the steam with three leaves and uh, one flat tail. For the fifth green bubble uh, to the very end of the flat tail. Fix all bubbles in proper positions. Alright, uh, now we are going to attach the stem to the flower. For the last three pink bubbles uh, between uh, green bubbles of the stem. Fix all bubbles in proper positions. Put the small pink bubbles directly under the uh, green leaf bubbles. It would make the leaves uh, slightly pointing to the top. Congratulations, you have made the flower. There is another way to make the flower on a shorter stem. This time uh, for the stem I'm going to use six petals green flower. Here's a green six petals flower which is a short stem. And here is uh, our blossom. I used uh, yellow balloon to make it. Use scissors or your fingers to cut off the ninth bubble of the blossom. As well we get rid of the rest part of the yellow balloon. Tie a knot at the end of the yellow balloon. Now we can attach the blossom to the stem. Lock the knot of the yellow balloon uh, between bubbles of the green balloon. Fix all bubbles in proper positions. Congratulations, we have made the flower. This flower looks like the blossom of a rose. Well, at least it's what I was told it looks like. Have fun and happy twisting.